Alright guys, I am Jake from Team Insanity. I have uh, the Velcan Crusade clothing line in front of me. I have the pants and the jersey. I have the jersey on. I'm going to tell you my thoughts about it. So, the jersey, um, it says that it comes with padding. This is uh, this is the pads right here on the elbow. There's not really much there. Really, in all honesty, the only reason why it's like, I'd say it's reinforced elbow. So, when, if you're diving in, you're diving in properly, you know, with your with your uh, forearm like right here instead of like this or some crazy shit you're like diving in right here it's so uh, it doesn't break you have a little bit up here on the shoulders and that's about it for padding it's just it's really a little bit for bounces not not so much like you know this is not going to replace your arm pads you won't really even notice it um and i've had this jersey for two years it's the 2011 one um and the only wear is this right here is like the fabric is kind of coming out like you can see where it's white and everything that's from taking my pack and having like the velcro overlap and by ripping off the pack so many times that the velcro just kind of pulled on the jersey a little bit so that's that's about it and if you have like OCD like Jacob the V on the stitching just kind of like is a little bit coming apart there because, uh, you know, again, Velcro on the pack. But, you know, I don't have OCD, so it's not like I'm ripping off my Velcan logo here because, uh, you know, it's a little bad, I guess. So, other than that, it hasn't ripped. And like I said, I, I've had it for two years. I've done some crazy, uh, pretty crazy stuff with this thing. And um, it's really not that bad. The thing that I really like about this is that right here, this black stuff that you see right here, all this is it's see-through. I don't know if you can see my shirt that well, but it's like it is so thin and it is so breathable. And it's on this side too. All this nice black stuff is that it's just nice and thin, nice and really breathable. So if you're out there for a long time, you'll stay very, very comfortable. You like you you basically have like nothing on you. And it's the same too with this. It's a little bit thicker, but not much. That's just because it has the design on it but it's still really, really thin. I can see my hand through it, um, and it's still really durable. Like I said, the only wear is just from over two year time, my pack has started to pull a little bit on the uh, on the stitching and kind of wore it off. The other thing is that it's um, it's it's really nice and flexible, so I can, I can move my arm easy, even though you don't want a chicken wing, but I have a lot of extra room it's nice they give you a little bit extra room in here so it's not like your normal average t-shirt where it's like tight up on your pits kind of thing it's nice and uh... nice and breathable and flexible kind of thing so that's the jersey let's bring in the camera and do some stuff on the pants right, so this is the pants so i'm just gonna work my way from the top all the way down to the bottom basically so the pants is gonna take a little bit longer because they're they spend a lot of time on the pants because if you're gonna be uncomfortable kind of thing this is where it's going to be is your your lower body kind of thing but uh what i what i like about the top is that you have these little straps okay so if you're unsure about your waist size or if you're like me and you shop at more than one different store and you you're like in a 31 waist at you know abercrombie but then you're in a 33 waist at you know aeropostale or something like that okay it's kind of, you know some stores run you know they're weird um, you won't really have to worry about that with this. I mean, you don't want to get like a 40 waist when you're like, you know, obviously in the 30s. But if you shoot for right around where you're at, this will be no problem at all because you have these, this is like your belt right here. This, this nice little Velcro, you can adjust the sides. Um, you can adjust what's on your sides. Um, and that's very, very good. So you can make it tighter, you can make it looser. It's very, it's very helpful that I've found because um, I got mine a little bit bigger and as um, as I've you know I've had like I said these for two years and I've adjusted it slowly throughout the years you know as I grow and get bigger so that is very very helpful so it doesn't get tight on you um, the next thing is this nice little crotch protection I mean it's not much like I said it's not gonna replace your slider shorts or your cup or whatever you, you're using but you know it's it's a little bit more it's a little bit you, less uh it's a little bit less than i really like but it's still there it's still something to think about but what i don't like about it i mean it's not really something to worry about but 
what, but I just don't like, you know, I don't want to go through a maze when I have to go pee. So, what this is, um, you have to do this little button right here. You have to undo these two buttons. You have to rip this Velcro. Okay, and you got this zipper do doohickey thing in, uh, and you gotta unzip that. So it's kind of like a little maze, especially if you're like standing there on the field with your paintball gun. Uh, you know, it, that's, that's, you know, it's not that big of a deal, but still, want to point it out. Kind of, kind of thought it was a little funny. Um, next thing is that you can see there's all these different, you're probably going to be seeing like all this different black, these little black uh, spots right here. Not this, this part. What they really did is I really like Velkin. This is like some stretchy material right here, okay? So you can take this and right here in the crotch too. So they, so where you bend and where you slide. So if you're running, you're, you won't have to worry about ripping your pants or anything like that because this right here, is, if you look in the crotch, this bends, okay? So this material starts to bend and stretch to the form of how you're running to the form of how you're um, how you're in your bunker so if you're have one knee up and one knee back you won't really have to worry about that because guess what this is gonna stretch and conform to um, your crotch size and that kind of stuff and so is this this is gonna stretch on your sides kind of thing and this part this black part is some nice nice venting so you'll still stay nice and cool on your pants okay you have some nice little, uh, nice Velkin logo here. I mean, hey, it looks cool. Velkin designs overall are pretty, uh, pretty sick. And then um, you have the little squeegee holder right here. I'll get to that um, in the conclusion. Then you have these pockets. I mean, it's not like you're carrying much on the field. And then you have some more venting all the way around the knee pad. Okay, so here's your knee pads. Once again, it's like the jersey. It's not going to replace your knee pads. All this is is it's some really really tough like I don't know like what material to call it but it is really thick and it is really um, really tough material because if you go to slide I mean this is like basically your shin to, to the top of your knee a little bit above so if you if you slide a lot if you do a lot of knee sliding I mean Superman sliding anything like that you won't have to worry about this ripping okay like I said had these for two years the only wear is like some stains over here. No rips at all right here. There is no stitching coming out. No stitching coming out over here either. That is very, very nice. It is very well made for the price. And also the other thing is the knees. So when you bend your knees, this also stretches. There's there's that black stuff that I was talking about. The um, This little stretchy material. It's right underneath this... Here, here's where your knee should be at, is right here. So if you go to kneel down and, you know, your, I don't know, your pants get a little bit tighter right up here, guess what? This will stretch so you don't rip your pants or wear them or whatever you got to do. So this is very nice right up in here. Next thing, I see this a lot with, you know, older style pants that I see people wear, is that they'll just let them dangle down or whatever and it, you know when you start stepping on the ends of your uh, pants they they tend to rip okay what you can do with these is that I find this very very helpful and this helps the um, the life of your pants dramatically like this is this is amazing what they did right here so you can take this velcro part and say you're wearing boots okay you might not need to do that but if you're wearing cleats like me okay You'll have to take this sometimes and move it around your ankle and basically it'll form to your ankle size, okay? So it's not, so you're not um, stepping on the ends of it. So when you're walking, if it's a little bit longer on you, a little bit baggy, you won't have to worry about that because you can fit this nice around your ankle so you won't have to worry about stepping on your ends, ripping the end of them, anything like that. So this will conform to your ankle size. I found that very helpful I don't step on the end of it I found that with my camouflage just some cheap camouflage pants they lasted me about a year and the whole entire it ripped all up you know all up my uh, my leg that was a uh, uh, that was a problem um, now to the back there's not much back here um, except for some there's not there's no really padding but it's reinforced on the sides um, you know they have a little bit more material for you know it bends right here too this little Velkin logo in this part 
is uh, it's actually really sticky. Well, not like a sticky is not the word, but it's like a, um, it's kind of it's like a it's like a rubber almost where um, your pack won't be sliding around as bouncing up and down as much. So it, it it's supposed to you know snug up your pack. I mean, does it do much? I mean, eh, whatever. I haven't really noticed that much of a difference. Um, all of this nice black part is nice and reinforced. A little bit of venting and uh, here's all of this venting. When you have a nice breezy day, you'll stay nice and warm, especially if you're just wearing this. You will feel the breeze. It is amazing. And a little bit, and here's some more reinforcement. So like I said, two years of two years of playing nonstop. And look at, do you see anywhere here? Here's one little piece of thread. That's like the only thread on this whole entire pants that is coming out. One thread. There is nothing else on here. So they are very well made pants. Um, so let's bring the camera out again and let's do the conclusion. Okay, so in conclusion, overall, for the price of this, you really don't need to go out and buy dye gear, planet gear, or anything like that because this looks amazing it's cheaper than all that this is not two hundred dollar pants the the crusade i would definitely recommend it because you know like i said for what you're getting for the money i'm so happy with this i don't even i've never used dye pants and, and i never will because these are nice and cheap and they get i i don't have anywhere on them they're great venting and you know they they're amazing um the thing that i would recommend is if you wear like a like a medium sized long sleeve shirt then get a large jersey or if you wear a small long sleeve shirt then get a medium jersey the reason why is because it's more baggy so you'll get more bounces like if a paintball were to hit me right here and all this it'll just it'll just slide right off but if it hit me right here I'm screwed so if you have some like some tight clothing like this it'll be able to hit you you're not gonna get any bounces but if it's hitting you like right in here you're going to be get, getting bounces on this crap all day. Or if you're getting hit in here, bounces all day. If, you, if you're like all playing tight and you have all this extra material in here, and it starts skimming your forearm, it'll bounce off this crap all day. Trust me, because I've had it happen. It'll just keep on bouncing off of all this scrunched up, uh, all this scrunched up material. So you always want to get like a size larger, extra large, and you know, if you wear an extra large shirt I wouldn't ah uh, I mean going to a, a double X you get a little bit more in the belly and a little bit more on the sides and length so if you're just kind of like a shorter guy but you wear extra large you might get a lot more in the gut and more on the sides so and a lot longer so it might be a skirt it might not it just depends upon your size on um, the pants like I said they're still amazing they'll fit you forever they match my socks I mean hey come on the thing that I that I really I don't have much to complain about, but with the squeegee pocket, I mean it's like this in, in like every every pants. But if I have knee pads on, like right here, sometimes it'll catch the edges of the padding, and the squeegee will slide up, and it'll and it'll just stay there, and it keeps on sliding up, and by the time it'll just fall out, and I don't have a squeegee sometimes. But that's like in every pants, you can't really complain about that. I see squeegee pockets down here sometimes. Um, I like those, but up here is fine. It's really nice. It's really light. It's it. You'll stay cool all day. It's amazing. Don't go buy dye or planet stuff. I mean, yeah, they're good, but for the price of what you're getting here, there's no reason to pay two hundred dollars or whatever. So, they're really nice. Velcan Crusade. Check them out. They're amazing. Great for team gear. You can't go wrong. Thanks for watching. Happy balling.